Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Vinod Gopal. As part of this episode, let us understand how to determine last day or last date of a given month based on a given date. So you all know this particular requirement might be very common whenever you are doing some customization, be it using an ABAP in your ALV report or LC1. If you are a BW ABAP consultant, you might also need to determine the value of a last day half a month maybe in your bex or some other places so in that case how can we calculate based on a given date how can we calculate last day or last date of that particular month it is very tricky because generally some month will end on 30th date some on 28th generally february during leap year it will be 29th and some will be 30 31st correct so now we have to identify this programmatically so as part of this episode let us understand how can we implement the logic come on guys let us start today's session so just to give a overview so there's a function model given by sap called sls underscore misc underscore get underscore last underscore day underscore of underscore month this is the function model given by sap this function model is present in both in ecc bw in the higher version of ecc such as s4 in the higher version of bw system such as bw on an r bw for an we can make use of this particular function module and uh, determine our last day of a month so this function model has two things one is input and output input it will accept a date in a form of yyyy mmdd it's an internal date form in sap it will based on the given or pass date to this function model it will calculate and uh, give you the output in again in a sap internal date form this output value would be the last day of that month okay so let us get into the system and uh, understand how can we call this function model and see one use case okay so let me log into an ec system so whenever you have a requirement all you have to do is search for that uh, requirement if there is any function model exist in google you will get most of the result in top one or two or third search result because it is not you are the first one to search or get this kind of requirement there are millions of other technical consultant might have got this particular thing as a requirement so what is our function model name it is sls misc get last day of the month so now click on display you can see there are code which is implemented by the sap is uh, technical team because this is the function model given by sap standard function model okay so it has two things one is importing and one is exporting importing is day in which you are passing and uh, the function model is going to provide last day of the month as an exporting parameter so now this is ecc the same function model is also present in your bw system if you have to check copy the function model name let me log into my bw on hana system enter my credentials go to sc37 click on the function model technical name enter the function model technical name click on display the function model exist in even bw on hana so you can make use of this function model both in ecc and bw so now how can i test the function model you can click on this i am currently in ec system click on execute f8 so here you have to enter date in a your internal format so generally it's a display format for your id 01011 so if you see in 2024 january month has 31 okay similarly if i change this to 01022024 2024 is a leap year february month as day 29 okay last day of february month is day 29 got it guys so you can make use of this function module to determine the value of a, a given month based on a given date you wanted to derive the value of 
last day of a month you can make use of this so how can we call this function model let me quickly create a program so z venu underscore uh, demo 24 okay pgm1 click on create fm call to get the last date half a date her day based on i n p u t date okay type executable program click on save save under your respective package now the program got created so now i wanted to have a date local variable lv underscore date lv underscore i can call it as in date type side item or dats i'm declaring a variable which is of type date i also declare one more variable called output variable out date okay so now i can initialize this input date with an parameter which is entered by the user in the selection screen otherwise i can enter any value in a form of 2024-0101 generally in sap date will be in the format of yyyy mmdd clear so now i have to call the function model to determine the last value output date correct so now copy the function model technical name how can you call the function model in your program there will be a pattern button click on this button enter your function model name save ok you get this so now day in what you're going to pass you're going to pass the date input date and you can uncomment this and last day of the month we are going to accept from the user we are going to pass the program variable lv underscore in underscore date to day in parameter of your function model from the function module our function module will determine the value of last day of the month and put it into this variable so now i am going to accept that value into this program variable clear guys once it is done what i can do i can just make use of write command to print the content of last day is okay i can put or print the content of this lv underscore out underscore date check the syntax activate this guy execute this see last day of january is 31st if i change the input value from january to february 2024 it has to be 29 because 2024 is a leap year got it this is how you will be able to make use of this function module to determine the value of what guys last day of a month hopefully you guys could able to understand how can you determine last day of a month based on a given date so if you like this video please do subscribe to my youtube channel also if you are looking for online training on sap abap sap bw bw abap bw anana b4 anana or native anana and anana related sql and also advanced sql programming such as amdp procedure and table functions you can always reach out to me on my mail id that is venugopal mn1988 at the rate gmail.com you can also call me on my mobile number that is plus 91 followed by 973-998-3992 thank you so much guys and have a good one stay tuned to the next video Bye bye